So earlier I made a video about what I think is coming to Path of Titans in 2021 and well today I'll be doing that but for Draconia, the upcoming dragon game that I cover a lot on this channel and I'll be telling you what I think will be coming to Draconia in 2021. Now remember this is my opinion, this is my view. None of this is fully confirmed, so don't expect it to happen. This is just what I think will happen. But other than that, if you guys are new to the channel, feel free to like and subscribe if you want to see more dinosaur and dragon game videos like this. And also join my Discord server. Anyways, guys, other than that, let's get right into this video. So in 2020, we saw quite a bit of things for Draconia. We saw its Kickstarter or its crowdfunding campaign come to fruition and it doing rather well in terms of getting a following and getting a backing for the project. And then we saw the early access version of the game being released for people who have the early access version and of a key for the game. This allowed people to play the game and well it saw the birth of the game overall. We saw two dragons come in this year and then we also saw the golem. We saw the European dragon, the lindworm and the golem be playable all in the space of this year. And well obviously by now you've probably guessed this section will be about the dragons and I think in 2021 we will see at least double the amount of playable creatures in the game by the end of 2021 but what creatures do i think will be coming to the game firstly i think we'll be seeing the eastern dragon definitely this is like one of those things where i'm confident we will see the eastern dragon being a playable in the definitely future updates it'll be the next playable in the game why do i think this well personally they have shown the Eastern Dragon a lot. They've shown it so much and they're even, they've are even they even said this will be the next creature. We thought when the Golem came in, that would actually be the Eastern Dragon, but it was the Golem instead. You know, it was that little tiny midget that's about the same size as me. You know, a midget who's like absolute tiny rock man that looks absolutely tiny and he's always looking up at his friends because he's an absolute midget and like... <laughs> it reminds me of me because I'm so small. Did Levi do this as a gag to make fun of Veloci because he's so small? So she added the little tiny rock man. So I think the Eastern Dragon will be coming into the game as the next playable dragon and I think it'll be coming in Q1 of 2021. What other dragons do I think will be coming into the game? I'm thinking later in the year we'll either see the Behemoth or the Wyvern and then towards the end of the year we'll definitely see one of them two or the final one of them two come into the game. The reason why I think the Wyvern will come first is because that one's the first one announced. They've only just started working on the Behemoth's model so maybe just maybe we'll be seeing the Wyvern first, although I rather want to see the Behemoth first because we got the Eastern Dragon, which is a flyer. Then we got the Lindworm, which is not a flyer. Then we're getting the Eastern Dragon that is a flyer. And then we're getting maybe a Ground Dweller next. I don't know. I'm also thinking we get, we get the Quetzalcoatl either in the later part of 2021, you know, the back end around Christmas, or we get it in very early 2022. It really depends what you guys think. What what do you think will be coming to the game? I really want to know. To add to this, I think the Drake and the Griffin will be playable this year. The Griffin will be the first one out of those two because the Griffin is pretty much almost done. And the Drake is also starting. The model's been going for the Drake since the beginning of time. I mean, since September-ish since when I covered it, since the Eastern Dragon was announced, the Drake has been worked on. So I think the Drake will be coming this year as well. Feel free to let me know in the comments down below what you think will be coming out of them. Well, this is one thing that I'm fairly confident will be happening in 2021 for Draconia, and this is to do with the world. Now, you may be wondering, John, what is there to do with the world? Are we seeing new biomes? Are we seeing some cool new caves and stuff? No, I think we'll be seeing a brand new world, a remake of the world. In fact, no, we will be seeing a remake of the world this year because they do just announced it in the Discord server today, and I'll be covering that in a brand new update about the game coming soon when the next development update drops because they'll definitely be mentioning that in that dev blog. But yeah, I think there will definitely be a brand new update to the world. In fact, we'll be getting our own very world for Draconia and it'll be a very cool one at that. Now, 
I really want to see the progress on this. In fact, we have seen some pictures and I'll be putting them up on the screen now. This I'm confident will be coming in 2021 because why else would they be teasing it at the beginning of 2021 if it were to come out in 2022? Of course, one thing I really want to see get a huge development if we're getting a new world and I really want to see brand new caves. I want to see more development of the caves. We have that really big cave and we have some other little caves dotted around. But I really want to see some more cool caves coming to the game because caves are going to be a big part of the story. They're a big part of the game and so I really hope they do come to the game because well it's more of stuff for us to explore. I also really want to see more human structures or more dragon people structures in the game. We have the villagers, we have the hunting lodges and we have some other stuff regarding them in the game but I want to see a bit more you know they spice up the world. Maybe we could see them getting populated with some cars say the dragon people of Draconia. I really want to see them populating the world that will look pretty neat one thing I definitely want to see out of these other stuff, firstly, I want to see the dedicated servers come to the game. Now, why am I saying this? Well, dedicated servers are quite important to Draconia because at the moment, we're just going off player-hosted servers. And so, obviously, these servers are not really the best for the game because, well, the owner of the server has incredible view distance. And to add to this, these servers are prone to just being laggy because it's based off of the owner's internet and not their own independent servers. I think we'll be getting our very own core server that will be up all the time for Draconia. At least one of them coming into the game this year. Now we're adding a whole load of spice to the game. And it'll mean that we'll be able to play whenever we want with whoever we want on this server. And it's a good pivotal point in the game's development and the community's development if we have something like that in the game. Personally, even if there's one dedicated server, I'll be pretty happy. If there's one server that is online all the time, I'll be pretty ecstatic by that. And that's something I definitely want to see more of. In the game. One thing I think we'll be seeing as well is animations regarding combat and other animations akin to that over the year. I think we'll be seeing some roars, some sound effects, and you know, some extra stuff that will be coming with the dragons. And I definitely think we'll be seeing some dragon combat coming into the game in 2021. That'll be very interesting to see, and I'm pretty excited for stuff like that. One final thing that I hope does get released this year is some part of the skill tree. The devs have said they are working on the skill tree, and they've just started working on it so hopefully they can squeeze that out by the end of the year what do you guys think do you want to see the skill tree i really want to see what the skill tree will be like in the game i also want to see some more stuff to do with that ui in the bottom at the moment we have food hunger and health i want to see some you know mana some stuff like that some of the attacks and stuff being able to be used in the game anyways guys feel free to let me know what you think about this video what do you think will be coming to draconia in 2021 i really want to see if your estimates are right as well but other than that i hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day. Peace.